Um, rappers being okay, rappers' lyrics being used against them. This is what one, one thing we were talking about earlier. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I said I'm fighting like Ali Mohammed. Thank God that I'm alive. I'm so honored. Cause I could have got murdered on a cold corner. Cause the youths where I'm from grow with no order. Right? And it's a, some, it's a common thing that's been happening. You know, rappers getting their fucking lyrics bought up in court. Um, shout out to Smiley for the interview that people just finished listening to. He even talked about that in how the boy them ran up in his yard and were fucking... Oh, in his trap. Yes. Yeah, ran up in his trap and were singing his tunes while they were raiding him. Cops, like, just don't know who we are more and then, mm. you know, they're raiding our traps and stuff, singing our songs and stuff, you know? Wow. Yeah. Hold on, the boy them are singing your songs? Yeah. Actually, our first song, Too Much, you know? They came, raided the crib, and they're making jokes and stuff. You know? Like, like cl clowning and like, ah, singing one of his tunes, mm -hmm. right? So, one of the things, <coughs> the gentleman's name there that you showed me the thing of? Oh, Lamar Skeet. Lamar Skeet, right? Yeah. He's going Ammo. through a, a, a big a case. Um, and I, I guess his lyrics have been bought up in the, in this case. Is this a common theme that's going on? Yeah. It, like, well, yeah. If you keep telling on yourself, I mean. Now my qu some people are saying, is it really telling on yourself or is it, is it <clears> art? It sucks because you kind of got to tell on yourself to keep it real. Yeah. Right? In this rap world, like that's what's glorified if, if you're a real nigga. Right and you, what what else do you have but your stories if you're actually a real nigga you know what I mean so you don't want to fabricate anything it goes against your character but at the same time you don't want to incriminate yourself so it's like and plus you see other rappers who rap about this shit all the time and you're like they get away with it they're yeah. fine not knowing that those guys are fake then they've never done any of it their yeah. stories that they're niggas or it's, somebody that they know. Shit. It's all hearsay. It's somebody else's story usually. Yeah. I, and I don't think that they tap into that. I don't. Th I don't think that that's ever a focal point. I think it's always their brand is them, and they don't think that they could take another nigga's story and tell it. But you can do that. There's no rules to this shit. Like, there's nothing saying you can do that, especially if it's a story that's similar or like of the same, you know, magnitude. Mm. Why not? Why would you use your own story? And potentially incriminate yourself if someone does go digging. And well, it's the keep it real thing, right? Like, just, like you even well, started by say, saying, yeah. you got to keep it real. Yeah, you know what I mean. And besides that, like people talk about what's around them, right? Mm. So, and I do agree. Sometimes rappers get a little too personal. And this is as a former rapper myself. I fucking incriminated myself on records over and over and over, and over again. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Snitching on yourself. Yeah. So it's like now when I pull back and I'm like Fuck podcasting. Fuck two gal, my girl doesn't know. <laughs> like, well, she does now. <laughs> she was like listening. <laughs> no, like I've had conversations, even that right, right there what you said. Yeah. I've had conversations where I'm talking to a girl. She's, li you know, we're listening to a tune and one of my tunes are going through in the car and she's like, that what you really did and I'm like thinking to myself no it's just music but like I'm kind of like keeping it real right yeah. like yeah I'm just yeah, talking I about that <laughs> I actually She's really like, did that pull over <laughs> <laughs> you're a <Right>? monster <laughs> so, let me out now if I was let a guy <laughs> who's out there shooting down mans and all types of shit and now I get in the booth and I'm like, yo, shot two mans. You know what I mean? Mm. 44 Glock hit them in the I mean, head top oh, Mitch caught a body two weeks ago yeah. right there's entire mm. parodies about these things, so like, is it freedom of speech though? Because that's one of the things. I you mean, you're freedom free of speech. To, if you're, just like anything else in the world, you're free. You're free to say nigger if you're a white person. Go ahead, but you still have to live with the consequences of the things you say. Facts. That's at the end of the day. If you can feel, if you feel like you can say certain things, by all means, say whatever you want. Mm. But you gotta know your own level. Like, that's my gangster. <laughs> like you gotta know what your own level. You know what I mean? Facts. If you're if you're a white person saying nigga in a amongst a whole bunch of black people and you're confidently saying it mm. and you know what's gonna happen. Shout out to Sachi. Freedom of speech, <laughs> man. Say what you want. I have the freedom <laughs> to also knock you out. <laughs> like it's just that simple. Yo, you know what? You're right. You're right. You're right. What do you think? Should rappers Shout pull out to back? Saji, man. Shout out to Saji. <laughs> <laughs> should rappers pull back? Should, should, should rappers pull back and be like, yo, you know what? I'm not even, I'm going to just start rapping about, like how Marlon's saying, oh, rap yeah. about like well, shit around you rather than your own. I would, I would think to rap about 
things my bedrooms that are in the field as well are doing. You know yeah. what I mean? It's not snitching if it's because they're gonna at the end of the day, police are not thinking that these songs are about your bedrooms. Like mm. for the most part, they, they don't even know what these songs direct. are. They have a man that's a rat and he comes and interprets. <laughs> 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 yeah, when he says one two, that means like, yeah, just now. Like, <laughs> 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 like you know what I mean? <laughs> so it's like at the end of the day, it, it, it's it's whatever you choose to put in there, you're going to yeah. have to live with it. Just think of it that way. Fuck. So it's a double-edged sword, pretty much. It is a double-edged sword. Yeah. But it's like the same rules apply in the real world. Like, I understand why it's that difficult to understand. Like, and I get maybe when you, you have your, your notoriety up to a certain level, mm. then maybe you can get away with those things. Even yeah. then... It depends on where you are. There might be even more eyes on you. <laughs> well, nobody's coming at Jay Z for the ninety-two bricks that he lost because there's no proof that he lost ninety-two bricks. He keeps on telling us he lost these ninety-two bricks. We believe him because we want to. <laughs> but it's like Marlon was we, saying, we've never seen these. It could have been his man that lost ninety-two bricks. It could have been his man. Like it could have been Emery. Yeah, well, Emery, did, Emery did ten. Right? Well, and well, he's like, he got a good lawyer. <laughs> he beat up, yo. The no, but he's like, Emery did 10 and he never spoke on what I did. What did you do? And why aren't nobody investigating you? Like, I'm not saying, I'm paraphrasing. I'm not saying, what if people Jay go got rid of the work Jay. when Jay, Emery was chill. getting locked? Okay, I'm not saying, boy, I'm going to investigate. Jay could have gotten rid of the work when Emery was getting locked. Okay, but is he saying, is he able to say it because he's past his statute of limitations? Yeah, definitely. Excuse and me. because he's right? Jay Z. Yep. No, because Nigga the men are the like, president. Jay gets away with saying this. Why can't I say it? Because it's Jay-Z. Tell him again. <laughs> the man came in the game and told everybody what he was going to do. He did what he said he was going to do. He's a god. Like, what yeah, are you going to do? Yeah, but he's allowed to talk about how much drugs he sold and how he's much. He's a god. Yeah, because what are they going to do? They're going to run up on, oh, okay, J.I., you, you know. you got to be better than what you're talking about. It's that. It's It's just that. Yeah. At the end of the day, Jay Z is better than everything he talked about that he's done bad. We ignore it. The man talks about shooting his He bro. stabbed someone. We don't care. And he talked <laughs> if anything, about it. It makes him more sick. Excuse me. <laughs> to the man tomorrow, like, but that's ah, a, he but that's a, the man. Like, but you see what yeah. I'm saying, though? Like, man are like, there's nothing wrong with that. Like, he even talked about stabbing Un in a song later on, yeah. half, years later. Statutes of limitations are up. But, like, man are like, yo. They're not thinking of statute of limitations. They're just like, yo, Jay says anything that he does. So if I just shot two mans yesterday, why can't I get in the booth and be like, yo, You're man, not. them, one headshot. Hey, come one. close. Come, come real close. I'm going to talk to you real close. You're not Jay-Z. Thank you. You're not Jay-Z. I'm sorry. It's just not... Not yet. Maybe. <laughs> but right now, you're not Jay-Z. Yeah. Man, them. You're not Jay Z. <laughs> that could be the title. <laughs> <laughs> Man, them, you're not Jay Z. <laughs> not, <Jay-Z. laughs> not yet, anyways. Not yet. Oh, where's my not phone? Yet. Put it in. Man, them, you're not, not Jay Z. <laughs> not, not yet. Because <laughs> anything's possible. Okay, am I, am I gonna put a, uh, this Drake auto tune? Drake said he turned into Jay. Mm. You think Drake can get in trouble for things he say? Drake's not talking about shooting mans in their yes, head he top. He's, he's getting the he's he one two bar. He said he's talking about he'll put the head in the neck. That's, a, that's a about Ooh. penis still. It's about, it's, about, it's about a dick pic still. Uh, I, I don't know about all that. That's that's just that's what it, that's what it Marlon. That's no what it man, yeah. that's not no. Okay. That's that was, not that. I mean, that's, that's the triple X bar. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly. what I thought it was. A triple X. But that's a that's, that's a bar that follows. No, <laughs> I only shoot that below the dead. neck. Triple X. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, penis. Flip it, yeah, okay. <laughs> all right, all right. But you thought he was talking about Vin Diesel. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, I got one more thing, or, I, or are we going to leave it alone? Yes, that's exactly. Because when you sent it back to me in, the, in our, in our um, DM thing here. What's this? You said it's fake. Auto-tune oh. arm plant. <laughs> they implanted in my arm, man. I'm going to show y'all. Look. Whoa. Whoa. Yo, look, check it out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the first nigga with it. I got this new thing. Like what, nigga? Stop. <laughs> oh, let me show you. I'm, sorry. I'm the first one with this. Yo, watch this shit, yo. <laughs> Who's that, Nestle? Yeah. Like how fake is that? Like? Well, how do people fall for these things? People want to fall for these things. <laughs> Why would it be in his arm and not his neck? Hold on, hold on. 
Does that make sense? Does Is your voice come out of your friggin' forearm? Is that fake? Nigga. No, man, I'm not playing, All dog. Right, like, no, your new the internet be- No, crazy. dog. Listen, uh, let me tell you something, okay? I have to call you Mecra D. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, uh, I'm on the I'm on, I'm on the gram all the time, okay? I'm always there. But sometimes these motherfuckers, dog, like, I'm like, come on, it's dog. so crazy. Who does this? Dog, I, yeah, I, I, I don't get what you're un- saying. I like, don't they underestimate do some crazy people things. anymore, Yeah, dog. yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I could be like, yo, this is clearly fake. And then really find out that the shit is fucking real. Like this fucking easy. Do you see really how big that thing arm. is? How deep into his forearm yeah. is that thing going? That is that hitting crazy. bone? <laughs> it's like crazy talk still. <laughs> this look at this motherfucker, bro. Look at it though. Man, looks like he has Yo, a car deck in his arm. If somebody just tuned in, they think we're talking about something completely different. So, man, okay. they just switch up the talks. A for the car people, deck. <laughs> for the people who are not Yo, who are the listening it, audience. How deep is that? Yo. <laughs> okay, you know, sorry, because yeah, I'm picking YouTube. But for the people who are listening in, uh, in the listening audience, there's a fucking thing that I just posted on Instagram it's with a out man. Of his forearm. He has a fucking thing in his forearm, and he's running the auto tune to that. Okay. Sorry. But it's like still. a robot, a robotic forearm, like a cyborg thing. This can happen. It's fake now, but it can happen. Yeah. Uh, are you think? Or are you saying the technology is there to do that right it's now? It's already there, dog. I, don't, I just don't think it would be in his forearm. I you think, don't think the so? logical place would be his neck, where his voice comes from. Just, <laughs> <laughs> just <laughs> is that a button in the back <laughs> flicking? Oh, man. That'd be incredible. T-Pain <laughs> would probably be the first man to have that still. He'd oh, have to. He'd man. have to be the spokesperson for the... For the company. I just wanted to clear that up, man. I just wanted to make sure. Would you buy that? Well, I, I don't make music anymore. Doesn't but if matter. I had now an you artist. Could. Now you could. If I had an artist. And You're implanting that shit in yourself? I'll tell him, fam, if you really want to get it popping on stage, you might want to invest in one of those arm this things. This guy stuff. got physically disgusted. <laughs> it's You're not for me. You're yourself, G? I'm retired, doc. I'm retired. But if I was a managing, managing artist. I mean, you're, you you're could re- turn you're into recommending one. that. Man, I'm not saying I am, and I'm not saying that I'm not. Man, implant themselves with Biogenics. Right well, fam, if you really, <laughs> really want to get it popping, you don't have to. Mm. But if you really, really want to get it popping, I mean, you be the life of the party. I'm just going to put it on the table and just leave it there. You be the life I of the party. I some still. other shit. <laughs> hey. I want to see the doctors that's advertising this procedure. Dr. So, Miami, for sure. First that's one. That's what it is, Dr. First Miami. Anyway. 